Hi everybody, welcome back. Well, I hope everyone is enjoying their weekend, a warm weekend here if you live in the United States, really a heat wave. So uh, be careful out there during the day in the sun. All right, well, for this screencast, let's take a look at the um, comments, your comments. This is a comments corner. And I will be commenting on the uh, comments for Zorin OS 6, the review, and what I consider even though it's it's not finalized, I still consider it to be one of the best. A lot of uh, one of the best. A lot of you have been commenting, so that I would take some time this evening to um, take a look and see what you've have uh, commented on. Okay, uh, just read it's based on Ubuntu. Uh, yes, that is correct, sir. Okay, great work as always. I may switch back to Zorn because of you. Well, thank you very much. Uh, Zorn has everything except stability. The only, the only thing thing it does consistently is crashing. I'm sorry to hear that, but or to read that, but I really haven't had that problem. Uh, I have the new Zorn six release candidate uh, installed and have been using it for a week now. Haven't experienced uh, any crashes at all, uh, and the little bugs in the ISO seem to vanish when I. Am when I when I'm actually installing, including the time thing. <laughs> uh, yes, I do know what you mean. Laughing out loud. Uh, there probably are some bugs which others have reported on the Zorn forms, but they should be worked out for the final release. I would agree. Looking forward for the final release of Zorn OS 6. Thanks for the update. Thank you. Uh, let's see. To answer to previous questions, uh, Zorin 6 uses Ubuntu 12.04. That is correct. So it will get five years of security updates. True. And I believe three years of software updates from Ubuntu. And the Mac OS uh, OS X look will, be a look will be available in Zorin 6 Ultimate. Uh, I believe you are correct. And that one will require a small donation. Let's see, this release is one sexy beast. Well, it definitely looks cool. Okay, let's see, Zorn OS's goal is to help make the change from Windows that they, what they have done. Uh, it's definitely, like they say on their website, it is a gateway from uh, you know Windows users uh, to the Linux operating system, based operating system on Linux, which is Zorn. So yes, it's definitely their goal to help you transition at least to try out Zorin. And then, you know, if you don't like it, go go back to Windows. I personally like using both. Oh, let's see. If it uses Ubuntu 12.04, that is very buggy on my NVIDIA card. I prefer Linux Mint. Debian runs much more stable. Yeah, it seems like in Linux, you know, uh, graphics cards drivers are pretty much a hit and, a hit and miss. Is there any software center in it? Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure there is. The package manager, uh, what package manager does Zorin OS use? It's based off Ubuntu, and I believe it's Synaptic, isn't it? Uh, let's see. Toss today, there is a way to get the Mac style. Yes. Uh, let's see. Awaiting Ultimate Edition. I'm sure a lot of people are. Uh, my only issue with Linux now is that my girlfriend's laptop, no distro of Linux, will allow the wireless card to work. Yeah, most wireless cards, I would say 90% uh, should work. It's a Broadcom card, and it just won't work, no matter if I download the drivers, ask it nicely to work, and or scream. Any advice, check the uh, Broadcom, Ubuntu, Ubuntu Broadcom uh, forms. Luckily with my uh, laptops, I haven't had any issues with wireless drivers. If, if, if anybody has a suggestion, please um, post it here for this gentleman. Uh, let's see, I guess someone did post, buy a wireless USB adapter. Maybe that's certainly an option. Uh, let's see, this is going back to that question. Uh, let's see, uh, I've, I've gone along with a lot of others in the past year or two using Linux more and more. Windows still does everything I need, but since I was primarily gaming, uh, Windows was the only choice. Yeah, I mean, I don't do any kind of PC gaming at all. I use my Xbox 360, but it seems even now, 2012, if you love gaming, stick with Windows. 
Uh, let's see. Is the taskbar look a new default? I really like it. Yes, it is. It's brand new. It's the event window navigator, I believe. Uh, if Zorn is an alternative to Windows, it should be able to play all the games. Windows, if it could, there would be no reason to pay for an, o an OS when you can get a better one for free. Well, once again, if you like, if it's primarily to, get to play games, yes, I would have to agree, stick with Windows. Uh, let's see, and I did comment, no Linux is as good as Windows for games. That is my, uh, my opinion, keeping in mind I do not play PC games at all. Uh, thank you very much. I love all of your videos, man. Thank you. I have a question. If I download and install Compass Config Settings Manager in Zorin, in Zorin will it work? Uh, wait till the, wait till the final release. Uh, you know the final stable release. Compass Config Settings is fun to play with, but there is a small possibility that it might break your system. Okay, Zorn OS 5 runs fast and smooth. I use it for a while until I got Windows 7, mainly because I had some older games and some newer games I planned on getting for my old computer. Sally, game developers, and Linux still don't have good support for games. It certainly seems that way. Uh, let's see. I did enjoy Zorn's plethora of features from a full set of Office tools to its free recorders, some games, and everything between A and, a and Z. Cool. I have a WN Navigator. Is there a way for me to install the Zorn OS theme so I can stay using Ubuntu? I know your answer might be no, but I hope you have a positive answer. But what did I reply? Do you mean Zorin theme desktop in Ubuntu? Not that I'm aware of. I think that's a proper answer. I'm not sure. <laughs> Sorry, it's been a long day. Okay, just a, a few more here. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, are the Zorn OS guys committed to updating the system with bug security fixes for five years? Uh, I believe so. Okay, I mean like the Zorn theme on the uh, AWN Navigator, but yeah, it looks like Zorn only, but well, a Cinnamon came to Ubuntu, I guess this will too anytime. Uh, I do, I do dual boot uh, the Linux, the new Linux Mate 13 with Cinnamon haven't noticed any issues be careful when you download different desktop environments there is a possibility of breaking your system Zorin looks like fun it's the new fun OS okay I think that's it for this comments corner for Zorin OS 6 review still one of the best in my opinion wait to the final release someone asked me once or tw has asked me once or twice the final uh, date for the release. I, you know, I don't think they've posted one yet. Go to the Zorn OS blog. That's usually where they post it. Uh, I'm guessing sometime in June, which is really what a week or two from now. Uh, although the final, although the final release, I believe, is fine. But if you want to be sure, wait for the final release. And I, I think Zorn OS 6 is going to be just fine and dandy. Okay, well that's it for this comments corner. Oh, and by the way, if you haven't already, the next Sunday Night News and Nonsense Report is up. It's Sinner number seven with the Linux A team. It's been uploaded to the channel. You can download the audio files on the Tosscasts uh, podcasts uh, website. This one had uh, Sysadmin Girl, Infinite Link Galactic, Spatry, uh, and myself. Uh, we tend to blend, you know, very good, you know, in terms of conversation and great team, as always. So take a listen. I never get tired of listening to this one. I think I've listened to it a half a dozen times. It seems weird, but I still get a chuckle out of it. But hopefully you will too. So check out the uh, Linux A team uh, Sunday Night News and Nonsense Report special for this uh, Memorial Day weekend for, th for this. Uh, well, I mean, like it's up now. But I suppose if you live um, other parts of the world, it is already Sunday night. All right. Well, that's it. Thank you for watching and listening. Welcome aboard all of the new subscribers. Uh, please leave your comments. Please support any way that you can. It is greatly appreciated. Thank you to all. And of course, you know how I like to end these. I will catch all of you sometime in the future. 
Thank you.